Hey, good morning, everybody. This is Brittany at Big Cat Rescue here in Tampa, Florida. It's a little bit later than normal on a Sunday, but make sure you share this and tag your friends and family. Alert everybody that we are live. Gonna give it just a minute so a few more of you join, but you can see that we are over here to celebrate our birthday boy, our final January birthday cat of this month is Mr. Kimba. He is our youngest tiger on property at approximately six years old now. So he is right there in front of us on his platform, but he is facing the opposite direction. <laughs> so in order to see his handsome face, I'm gonna walk back around the long way, kind of go inside of his little maze area because all of this is Kimba's enclosure that we're walking past. So he's over there on a platform. In order to get the direction that he is facing though, I'm gonna go in through like a mid little alley section, cross through some of the tunnel areas and we should see his handsome face. Here's his sign as well. So oh, sorry that Thursday did not go as planned. It never does. And that, that shows you that I rarely know what's going on around here. <laughs> I thought we were moving Kimba to vacation like real quick. And then I found out that um, IT Randall was here. He had already fixed the vacation camera, but I guess there was something going on with the night vision. And then basically the entire day slipped away and they were doing some weed eating and I guess they just kept finding more and more that they needed and wanted to do. So it did postpone our boy a little bit, but I was last told <laughs> that the plan is to move Kimba out to vacation rotation tomorrow. Hi, sweet boy. Can we just say hi to you? Hi, birthday boy. There's that birthday boy. Hi, handsome. Happy birthday, my love bug. You is six years old today? You is six years old. Oh my goodness sakes. Yes, uh, Jamie and Victor only work, they do a four day work week. And so they were not, Thursdays are their Friday, just like me. So with them not here Friday, Saturday, or Sunday, that means our boy is going to move hopefully tomorrow. So he'll go out just a day after his birthday for his month long turn in the vacation rotation. Two and a half acres of fun. And this kid loves it out there. So if you follow us on Instagram, you will see tons of photos, especially if you scroll through each of the posts that I make over there. You'll see lots of photos, especially of Kimba on vacation because that is his favorite. That's him's favorite, right? Yeah. So yeah, our six-year-old babe, he's our youngest tiger. He's not our youngest resident, but he's pretty darn close. It's kind of shocking how many cats we have under the age of 10. Because when I started eight years ago, we had like 100 cats over the age of 20, it felt like. So, lots of youngins. Lots of youngins now. Oh. Thank you so much for letting us hang out with you. Can I come this way a little bit? This might be easier to show your face anyway. Look how handsome. Look how handsome that baby is. Yep, our big cats get to rotate for one month at a time. So he was neutered about two and a half weeks ago and we were really hoping that that would help kind of calm him down just a little bit on some of his aggression. And it has a little bit, but to say he still isn't gonna roar in your face when he's had enough of you, that would be a lie. He's a tiger, <laughs> we do know that. But he does seem to be a little more relaxed. I'm hearing less and less people talk about him barking <laughs> at them. So, 
the breeze came through and rustled some leaves and he thought more people were intruding. It's still just us, buddy. It's just me and 130 of my friends. Yeah. Happy Sunday and happy birthday to Kimba. Thank you so much if any of you guys have donated on his birthday post on our Facebook page. I saw that some people this morning were sponsoring Kimba. There's only a couple days left in January, so if you've not sponsored a cat yet, you can definitely sponsor Kimba or anyone else, and that will get you entered in our January sponsorship drawing. That prize is going to be a painting for Miss Priya. So good, are you hiding? You think you're hiding there? You could flop back down. You could flop back down, sir. Yeah, he's such a good old boy. You're giving me that look like he kind of wants to yell at me. Did I wear out my welcome? Did I wear out my welcome, handsome? You're giving me Amanda face right now, and I love it slash don't love it. I love it slash don't love it, bub. You're so handsome. You are so handsome. Yes, summer and winter are our youngest residents. They both just turned a year last year. But then you've got cats like Filmo and Flint, Zucari, Alethea, Mr. Kimba, lots of cats 10 and younger right now. Thank you, Chris. Yes, if any of you want to sponsor this gorgeous face right here, you can do it at bigcatrescue.biz. You got one Amanda ear left and the other one's better. Yes. He definitely has her spirit. You definitely have her spirit, bub. Yeah. All right. Well, I love you. Our viewers love you. You, you're such a handsome boy. He's doing really well after his neuter, so he should be going to a vacation rotation hopefully tomorrow. I will be honest, I, I'm speaking um, in front of a class for Ohio University tomorrow morning, so I do not know if I will be live. Um, I don't know that I'll be volunteering this Tuesday, so it might be no live on Monday, but one on Tuesday, or maybe not. I don't know. <laughs> Please don't hold me to any of this. Flying by the seat of my pants always. All right, buddy. Thank you. Curb out around. Now, <laughs> the one I feel really bad that I didn't get to feature last week, because my plan was to show Kimba go on vacation and then pop over and go see Filmo. So Filmo celebrated his seventh birthday last week and I didn't get to show him. So that's where we're gonna go next. I don't like to wear out my welcome, so. <laughs> I like to leave on a good note. <laughs> Filmo is just on the other side of these kids. There's a ton of keepers here today, like a ton. <laughs> so we have like three people doing food prep and a bunch of people helping do a project. And then there's enough keepers for every single cleaning section. And that's amazing. So, so as I said, Kimba's our last birthday cat of the month. And we actually don't have another Celebrate Cat until about mid-February. So um, we will be doing the sponsorship contest again in February. And once we get up here to Filmo, I will kind of explain what that prize will be. So again, January prize winner will be the Priya painting. And February, we're going to draw a name at the end of the month for everybody who sponsored a cat in February. 
and your prize will be what I'll show you here in a minute. <laughs> to get to the filmo. Because I celebrated the cats oldest to youngest for January birthdays. So filmo turned seven, Kimba turned six, officially our youngest. There's a Frankie. Oh, I said I was going to show you what the prize would be. So, come February, the winner will get a name sign. And so if your name is drawn at the end of February, you'll be able to tell us who your favorite cat is. And whoever that cat is for you individually is whose nameplate sign you will receive as your prize. So that's exciting. So it doesn't have to be Filmo. Just as an example, <laughs> well, there's Frankie in the sunshine. So we will show you Filmo because he was a birthday cat for last week. And then beyond that, we'll just go see if any of his other neighbors are out and about. There's our Filmo. You can see it is the perfect time of day. Perfect time of day for everyone to bask on their platforms. Uh, Missy, I don't know about rainbow cats for the sign prize. Um, that would just have to depend on whether Katie still has those files available or not. We have all of our name sign files um together but rainbow cats they might have been removed and we certainly don't still have their name plates here physically on hand because generally when a cat does pass um, the keeper or keepers that had that cat as their favorite or just had a really really special bond with that specific cat they are the ones that get to keep those name signs so but we do frequently have to reorder and change up our current cats because this is Florida. So we could have an insane wind come through and crack a sign, uh, just the sun alone. They get kind of melty and faded and mossy and gross. So <laughs> yeah, so come February, uh, which is only a couple days away, you got to sponsor at least one cat and then you could pick a name sign as your prize. But for now, January prize is still that really cute Priya paw painting, which is so silly. They spelled out BCR with um, non-toxic paint, and then Priya gave it her little stamp of approval, and it's pretty cute. So this is our little Filmo, seven years old approximately. Looks thrilled, doesn't he? He's just ready to sleep all day. If you want to learn about Kimba or Filmo, our Celebrate Birthday Boys today, you can find all the bio pages, bigcatrescue.org slash catbio. Doesn't he look cozy? The other one that looks really cozy in the sun is Frankie. I'm hoping he'll stay right here. Can we watch you have your bath? Can we watch you have your bath? Yeah, hi cute boy. This is Frankie. Frankie and Filmo actually get along pretty darn well. Yeah, you don't seem to care about Filmo at all. It's just big shy guy. Just that big shy guy. Thank you to everybody helping out in the comments and answering questions. Mr. Frankie, you are just in the full sunshine it's pretty chilly this morning it's been it was pretty much no sun for the last two days and pretty chilly but today we're supposed to see the 80s so our bodies don't know what to do do they buddy we don't know what to do 
You're such a cute boy. You're such a cute boy. Yeah, sweetheart. Little oh, sweetheart. Thanks, buddy. Good to see you too. Oh, it's so good to see you too. Yeah. Such a good boy. Such a good boy. Gotta go do some patrolling or something. Oh, make sure I know exactly where that Shiloh is. Gotta know where that Shiloh is. Yeah. Back to Mr. Filmo. So that with this being our last batch of celebrate cats and not really having, we only have a couple cats that celebrate in February for birthdays and rescue anniversaries. That means we'll be back to just our regular old walkabouts. So each day I'll try to pick a handful of cats to feature and just kind of hang out with for as long as they will allow it. And hopefully we'll keep those donations and sponsorships going. Well, let's go see Filmo's other neighbor. Can't get him this close to her and not say hi. Small girl! Smalls! I see you over there! I see you! You better come over here in your favorite spot. Hi, lady. Hi, lady. Here she comes. Hi, princess. How are you doing? How are we doing? Hi, lady. Hi, lady. I missed part of what you just said there. So this is Smalls Bobcat, but I saw somebody say they couldn't find the painting from Priya on Dot Biz. Um, the painting I'm referring to for the sponsorship kit prize is not for sale. It is just a prize, but Priya does in fact have a painting um, that she did. It's obviously a print um, from the original. But all you have to do is go to bigcatrescue.biz and if you're looking for anything specific from a, from a specific cat, there are two ways to do that. You just go to the search bar and type in Priya Tiger and then everything that involves Priya will pop up. Um, or if you go to shop categories, you can shop by your favorite cat and it'll basically give you a list of species. You would click on tiger and then after that you would click on Priya. What are you doing, honey? Are you being sneaky? Are you being sneaky? Hi. Hi, pretty baby. I missed you this weekend. Yeah, I missed this girl. I missed this girl. I did. What a sweetheart. What a sweetheart. Did your keepers give you fresh water? Yeah, I saw them over here taking care of the girl. Now I think they're over there taking care of the boy. <laughs> okay. I do also want to mention from BigCatRescue.biz, she's over here rolling around, that we only have about 150 calendars left. So if you did not pick up your calendar, or you wish you'd bought a couple, or it's never too late to gift one to somebody that you'd like to introduce to Big Cat Rescue, 
Um, you can still buy those at Big Cat Rescued Up Biz as well. We would love to just totally sell out of them. I know a lot of people buy them just for the photography, so those are still available, but we've got about 150 left. What'd you find? You must have had enrichment there. That was very fun. Rubbing and rolling. What are you drooling on? There is some kind of very fun smell right there. A lot of times when the cleaners come through, they will pick up old enrichment. I mean, she's like really into whatever's there. And I've, I've had it happen to me before where I go to pick up a, like a spice bag from a day or so prior. And a lot of the herbs or scents will fall out of it as I'm pulling it out. There's a good chance that somebody dumped some catnip. <laughs> catnip or something. What you got over there? It's so silly. That is the silliest. <laughs> you perfect lady. I love how long she is. You're such a big bobcat. Fluffy belly. What did you find? We hand out daily enrichment and Smalls has never really been interested in sickles because we make blood sickles, fish sickles, tuna sickles, turkey sickles, chicken sickles, any kind of anything you can think of. We've probably tried it and she's never really been into sickles but she sure loves something with scents or spices so different perfumes. I've always done catnip and cinnamon that was my that was the key to her heart when we became friends. Years and years ago, huh? And that's still our ritual every Thursday is that I, and I always bring her a really huge one. Like they're supposed to, the big bags go to the big cats and the smaller bags go to the small cats. And I've always given smalls a big bag. You're so precious. You're so precious. Good job, lady. You're getting the the most bang for your buck, aren't you? She's like, because there's literally nothing there. Like, <laughs> I was like, well, maybe there's a, a bag under her somehow. Nope. Just a smell. Just a scent. It's getting hot out here, honey. You've got your winter coat on. You've got your winter coat on. How's Gilly? How's Gilly? She is all fired up. Where's that Gilly boy? She's like, I'm gonna go back to my smell. <laughs> oh, maybe there's a new smell. Is there a new smell? You are so silly. You just feel in the groove, aren't ya? <laughs> I don't know what she got into this morning, but it's fun. Very fun. What are you doing, sweetie pie? What are you doing, sweetie pie? Rah. Oh, now we're bathing. 
to show off how flexible we are. Gotta keep that tail clean since you show it to everybody. You show it to everybody now. Official greetings. Official greetings. I'm the best lady. The best lady. Hi. Hi. Rah. Okay. Yeah, I know. Good talk, sweet pea. I'm gonna go see if Gilly's out. All right. Well, that was pleasant. I think we'll try to see Gilligan, and then I know it has been a long time, I feel like, since I've really shown you guys summer. So we'll go over and see if we can get a summer sighting. And that might be where we wrap for today. So if you missed any part of this, we did start out with Kimba Tiger, since he is today's birthday boy. And then I had to check in with Filmo because he was last Thursday's birthday boy and I did not get a chance to say hi. Let's see where he is. And if there's even a good to view him. He might be in his AC den, but... Is he? Okay, perfect. Yeah, he has been, like, right there in those ferns most all the time, but... Here he is. <laughs> Here's our boy, surrounded by ferns. Might be able to go to the other side and show his little face. Um, Hi, Gilly. Oh, hi. Hi, my little prince. What you doing, bud? It's a gorgeous day. It's a gorgeous day. There's our Mr. Gilligan. Gilligan's a Canada lynx, so we just saw several bobcats, which if you note how amazingly different that all oh, they all look. Frankie's so brownish tan and a little bit of red and just shaped differently. And then you've got Filmo, who's very spotty and very just full of angles and lots of gray beard and then smalls nice big rough nice fluffy belly they all have that bobcat tail though and then we have mr gilligan you're so handsome buddy so Gilligan has now been heard and seen at least twice now while he's been hooing again. And Keeper Kristen caught it on video, so I know that I've posted it on Instagram as a reel, and I know that it was posted on Facebook as a reel as well. So if you missed that, it sounds a little bit different than it used to, but it was so nice to see him up walking around, hooing, hooing. He's so handsome, aren't you, Bubs? Just slide over just a little bit. You just have one piece of fern going right over your face. Yeah. Him's being such a good boy, too. He's eating pretty well. He does tend to leave some food in the morning, so he's been put on a permanent 
um, p.m. snack. So he won't eat everything in the morning and then we supplement and give him the rest in the evening. He's such a good old boy. That looks like a perfect nap spot. A little bit of sun, but a little bit of shade. That's me saying I love you, buddy. Yeah, that's me saying I love you. Hi. Hi. What a good boy. My handsome guy. He's just been through so much in the last couple of years. It's just so nice to see him just relaxing and Just being a good old boy. He just turned 16. All right, love. Enjoy the rest of your day. <laughs> All right. Let's go see if there's a summer. Maybe we'll see a Val on our on our way by. Pop in over here. Is there a Miss Val home? Not over here, I don't think. Nope. Oh, hi, Mrs. I didn't even see you, honey. Are you over here getting ready to tear your water bowl out of your lockout and run? Is that what you're doing? Hi, Miss Miss. Hi, my Miss Miss. Oh, it's good to see you too, sweetheart. It's good to see you too, lady. Is your neighbor out? Oh, what a good girl. What a good Miss Miss. What a good Miss Miss we're being. Hi, honeys. Oh, it's so good to see you. I know this is how I got peed on. This is it. You was being so sweet. And I was like shocked. And the next thing I knew, you peed on me. I think you know that you've still marked me, though. There have only been a couple of you, but you were the big one. This is Mrs. Claus. She's also a bobcat. She's being very friendly and flirty this morning. What got into you today? What got into Miss Miss? Miss Miss? <laughs> What's that Mrs. doing? Miss Miss? Doing some grooming. Oh my gosh. She is so precious, and when she has, she's also like the most bipolar cat here. She just hot one minute, cold the next. She is just so unpredictable. But we spent many years bonding as operant, as an operant duo. But she'd turn on me in a second, so. <laughs> she's just so darn cute. Just so darn cute. I love that you were waiting right here. You were just waiting right here. 
Ready for some attention. <laughs> okay. Sorry guys, it's, she's a two by four cat, so it's really difficult to show her, especially at specific angles. That just don't work in my favor. Let's see if there's a Valerie. I already see her. I just don't know if we'll see her face. Hi, Miss Val. Oh, what was that? Hi. Hi, Val. Hi, Miss Valerie. We're coming up. Guess, guess who's one of the cats that we're going to celebrate next month? It's going to be you. Yeah. She was named Val because she came in around Valentine's Day. I'm going to be honest. I am blown away, completely shocked that we, and I should probably knock on wood, but that we don't have any rehab bobs right now because... We almost always get them around every single holiday in the winter and spring months. Right? Yeah. And a little birdie told me, so right now I have three eBay auctions going and they are past rehab cats. So, so Makani and two from Orpheus, they are currently being auctioned on eBay. You've got another day or so, I believe, or they might end tomorrow. I can't totally recall. They started Friday. Started Friday for three days. I know, wild one. I'm telling, I'm telling them that you might be, I'm telling them that you might be part of a February one. So I've got some Valentine's-ish bobcats that <laughs> uh, I can eBay auction their paw prints in February so keep your eyes out for that <laughs> oh honey that first noise you made I've never heard anything like it I never heard anything like it <laughs> I know I love you I love you too good talk Thanks for letting us stop by. <laughs> okay. Well, we got a bonus missus and we found Val. So let's hope we can see Summer. And then that's where we're going to wrap it for today. Let's see if she's in her ferns. And there she is. Hi, honey. Hi, little lady. Less, less threatening ferns. Less threatening ferns. Uh-oh, it's going to be so hard to show you. There we go. Oh, I've got an idea. This worked for winter, so bear with me for a second. I'm going to take this off the stabilizer. Okay. Then I can hold it a little bit better. All right, lady. There we go. Where's our summer baby? All right, peacefully sleeping in her ferns. Way less scary ferns. Just as sneaky though. Just as sneaky though. Let me see if there's any better angle. There's that precious face. There's that precious face. Hi, sweetheart. Are you grumbling? Are you grumbling? It kind of sounds like it. I'm wearing your shirt today. I'm wearing your summer shirt. I was hoping for summer weather and it's going to be in the 80s, so boom. Well, another big thank you to everybody who joined me this morning, shared this, tagged your friends and family, and helped out in the comments. Really appreciate if there were any donations. You can go donate for Kimba over on our Facebook page. 
can sponsor any of these cats at bigcatrescue.biz. And I can't think of any other updates from the weekend. I think we'll, I believe we might still be moving Kimba tomorrow, but I don't know for sure. I don't know if I'll be able to live that or not since I will be speaking to a class. But otherwise, I hope you guys have a great rest of your weekend, a good start to your week. And I will hopefully see you guys sooner than later. My goodness sakes, lady. Don't get that tail going. Are you going to come out? You're staring at my feet, aren't you? You're like part Nabisco. What are you staring at? What are you staring at? <laughs> you just see a tail whipping around in there. Oh my goodness. All right, guys. Well, thank you so much. I really, really appreciate all of you. You guys are the best part of my every day. So thank you so much for being here and I will see you guys soon. Mm-hmm. <laughs>